this is Mrs. Mount, and in this video, I am going to show you how to download and use Cam Scanner to scan an assignment into your computer so that you can submit a handwritten document as a digital document and get it to me in the Dropbox. The very first step in the process will be to download the app from either the Apple Store or your Google Play Store. And the good news is, it is free. Just look for the icon that you see on the screen with the C and the S and download to any smartphone. All right, so the next step will be to either sign in or register. Again, use your GCISD email account and the corresponding password to register. It will ask you if you would like it to email you a verification, you want to go through that steps of getting the verification code and going through the account setup just as you would with any other app. If you have any questions about that, please call me. The next step is just to go ahead and sign in and you will be ready to use Cam Scanner at that point. Okay, so now you will be ready to scan your first document. You want to click on the picture button and you're going to choose single or batch. Because I have just one document, I'm going to choose single. And once I do, I'm gonna take a picture of my document I can adjust these sides to make sure that I'm including the entire document that I want to get in the scan and then click the check mark and it's going to create a scan. You can use different features here, original, lighten, magic colors, whatever you want to make sure that it's clear. So I like the way that that looks and I'm going to save the image. This part is where you will send it or share it with yourself. One great way to do this is to click share and it's going to create a PDF that you can upload to your phone or you can email it as a PDF and you can put in your email address. I'll put in mine. And then I can send. Now I'm just going to need to go to my email. I will find this email generated for me with the PDF attached. I can then download the PDF to my hard drive and pop it into a Dropbox and Connexus. The fourth step is once the app has sent you an email of your scan, you are going to go to your email and find your document just like I have, I've got an email from myself. It usually says new doc. And then I'm going to download that document. Since it is a PDF, it'll download. And then when you hover over the upper right hand side of the download, you'll see a little arrow where you can download it and then save it to your hard drive to whatever document folder you want to save it as and make sure that when you're saving it that you name it according to the lesson. For example, you may name it U2L12 for a Unit 2 Lesson 12 portfolio. The fifth and final step is to upload your PDF into the Dropbox within Connexus. Make sure that you submit the correct document. And if you have any questions on this,
please feel free to come in and see me in a tutorial or give me a call on my number. Information for tutorials and contacting me by phone or text will be on my Google site. Thanks so much and happy scanning.